<laughs> He's just trolling out of me right now. Okay, good. Good. I was like, really gonna go Donkey Kong after we just hyped this, this up. This matchup is booty for Falcon, though. Yeah, it's pretty bad. I think it's a solid 6 4, but at the same time, Falcon gets in. He can kill Pikachu super early, so. It's possible to kill him early. Yeah, definitely. So here we go. Game one. Going. They're still talking. They don't care. They were playing earlier, and when they play, my god, do they talk. They are, they I, uh, are screaming. I, I, I gotta say this because I thought these were pretty good words. Ryo, Ryuga looks over at Nero. He looks over at Meek. He's like, F this man up because he a bitch. <laughs> that's solid. That's solid. You solid know, that's the, that's the coaching advice sometimes you need. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I, I think I'd play better if uh, Ryuga told me that before every match. I was thinking the exact same thing. Yeah. I hope he tells me that before I have to play him in Brawl. Yeah, yeah, it. yeah. It literally <laughs> tells him to mess it himself up. Yeah. Wait, you gotta play him in Brawl? I probably. If I beat Jordan, if I don't, well, I mean, I'll probably just like. Quit, be right. sad. Yeah. yeah, no, I mean, if you need a buddy, got you. Well, fucking ditto. You guys aren't allowed to be buddies. What? You hate each other. I mean, it's <laughs> like a love hate, dude. It is what it is. Hey, <laughs> right, me. Love. I mean, I, I thought. <laughs> so, <laughs> me, Nero, uh, close game right now. You know, Nero and kill percent, for sure. Me, uh, getting close. And Nero just taking advantage of how fast he is and just punishing almost every option that he's making. Oh my god, he oh reversed goodness. it. Gonna get the explosion, but not gonna get the KO yet. Yeah, he definitely reversed that on purpose uh, to force uh, Nero to think, you know, rethink his uh, offstage game. Ooh, gonna miss it that time. In what? the dash attack, if that would have been the other way, I believe it would have killed, but this will be a dead Falcon. Yep, and that's why this matchup's butt. <laughs> like, I mean, he does have him up to 121, and now the slow walk forward. Oh, I'm not saying that he's not good at the matchup. I'm just saying that's the reason this matchup's like a Yeah, solid. it makes it hard. Yeah. Ooh, great ledge oh, drop good in ledge the drop right there. Yeah, gonna kill uh, kill Pikachu, and now we're back to zero percent. And Meek, oh, went for that back air to grab. Not gonna actually connect with it. And these forward airs yep. are so forward scary. Forward airs coming through, and a Nair coming through. Oh no, the SD from Nero. Why? And so Meek takes game one. <laughs> See Jordan pop off there. The Ryuga advice worked. Yeah, for sure. I got, need I need some Coach Ryuga in my yeah, life. I'm kind of sad right now. Coach Ryuga, Coach. that's the thing. Ooh, what is this? This is this is probably oh, the double pair. This is the SD. This is the SD. Yeah, the SD. What a play! I'm actually surprised he didn't. Get Maybe he up. thought he had a jump and he didn't have a jump, and by the time he realized it, he couldn't get his uh, up B out. Yeah, it was just too late. So, Meek taking game one. Uh, you know, even in an unfavorable matchup, Meek being the player he is, definitely capable of winning this. Ooh, great dash attack off the start. Gonna get three percent. God, that down air seems so unsafe. But Meek is one of those players that I can just tell he is so momentum heavy. When he feels himself, watch, get out of the way. Because next thing you know, you got up there seven, eight times, and you might get knee. Oh, like all of that's just even intimidating right there. Yes. Oh, great grab. Oh, my goodness. Will he get. Oh, he went for the back air, assuming. Interesting uh, choice. Nero might DI in really heavily. Very interesting. That up air to. Nothing. Down air attempt. Yeah. But Meek just running all over him, keeping that momentum. So. Coach Ryuga. Yeah, my God, this this coaching advice is just top notch. <laughs> and uh, you know, Nero not not allowed to play defensive right now. Like Meek took him to Smashville. Uh, I mean, I don't know how like, defensive you get to play against Captain Falcon. It's really only if Captain Falcon wants you to. Because if the Captain Falcon's trying to rush you down, he's gonna rush you down. Like that. Like he tried to back off and go to that platform to be a little more defensive, and he just up aired him. He's like, I'm fast enough to get there. I'm not gonna allow you to do that. And he's getting close to like, yeah, he's at back air kill percent now, so you might see Meek fishing for it. But you can even just tell by his movement, like he is, fe Meek is feeling himself, holy crap. Okay, we're gonna get something started here from Nero. Went for the Gimp, and yep. what a good call, because he is down by a lot. Say, so if he can get the uh, Gimp, he uh, he might uh, be able to just get back to more of a style that he's comfortable with, but as of right now, he's gotta stay on the offensive. Great uh, reacting grab right there from Nero. Oh, oh good. Oh, good there to get go. that attack. Good attack. Yep. That's something that I'm a firm believer you should just always be ready to attack, and then if it doesn't happen, just be prepared for the worst because you're Falcon. Yeah, you just kind of die. But yeah. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> like, Almost taking it. He did like jab, one, two, hung, he hung out for a second, and the third one came through. It just kill sparks. But Nero bringing this back. And uh, Pikachu definitely capable of uh, bringing this back oh, at any time. Good attack right there. Let's see. He just holds the jab. Even oh, good attempt there, but excellent power shield coming through from Meek, and he's able to get that down tilt to kick the KO. 
I like uh, a lot of Meek's punches right now. He, you know, he, ooh, oh, he's missing barely gonna again. Miss it. Uh, he gets that down tilt, which is such a smart thing to kill with. A lot of people don't respect that down tilt enough. That thing kill, that thing hurts, puts you in awkward position and kills. Yes. It's such a horizontal hitbox as well. Yeah, you go fly, like if you got a bad recovery and you get hit by that down tilt, like, okay. Uh, Nair gonna go ahead and take that one out. Sometimes those, like, moves that you don't expect to KO are awkward to DI. Yeah, that's true though. You, you don't expect to go far right by Nair, so. Oh, great uh, cross-ups right now yeah. by Nero, and then he's going to crouch the grab and just, you know, put on more <laughs> damage. But in the end, I think Captain Falcon's upbeat just did more than all of that. Yeah. <laughs> so, Falcon getting a reward for recovering. Oh, great back air. Going to put more percent on. Let's see how Meek makes this. Uh, well, now he has big up air. Yep, up air. Lots of up airs. He is waiting so yeah, long. Yeah, he wanted that knee, but he couldn't get the follow-up. He knew that platform was there as well, so he knew he always could make it back to uh, the stage if he needed to. Ooh, tried to catch out the up, be the quick attack. Okay, great up air. Uh, Nero was waiting on an option, and me just throwing the up air out. I'm going to connect and put 3% on. That back air was so scary. Super good jab. Yeah, Meek really, uh, you know, playing the uh, Falcon advantage there. Ooh, great stall by Nero. But yeah, Meek up 1-0, you know, like he's kind of, I don't want to say he's running away with this because Nero could definitely, definitely win this still. This yeah, it's not still, out of the realm of possibility, but. It's very much in the realm of it possibility. It just feels right like. Right there, yeah, almost. It just feels like, you know, Cat and Falcon momentum is so scary. Do you think that forward view is on purpose? No. Okay, me neither. Gosh, no. <laughs> that was him probably trying to do something like rard or, or uh, turn around, and it comes out side B. Forward throw. Gives kill sparks, it. and yep. it will kill. Meek up 2-0 right now, and Jordan is very excited yeah, about it. Yeah, Jordan's, Jordan's Meek's biggest fan. For sure. 100%. Popping off for him. Look at it. And now he's getting coaching sessions. I don't even from think Jordan. it is. I think it's just like this hype up. And Coach Ruga really, yeah. really coming through in the clutch here. Getting the best advice. Oh, my God. I wish I had that kind of advice. My God, I'd play so much better all the time. <sighs> all right. We're going to see Dreamland come through here. This is where Nero almost Yo, brought man. it back. Yo, ho. Get out there. <laughs> <laughs> Boom. Yeah. Got him. The advice. Coach uh, <laughs> Coach Kushi. Oh, wow. Pikachu. Run. There we go. This is this is exactly what you expect of this matchup. Like, yep, lots just, of combos. Yeah, just keeping him in the air and not allowing him to really get off anything uh, he wants to. Oh, great oh, jab. Oh, good jab. Almost had it. And, yeah, really starting off strong here. Looking like this counter pick is so oh. much more effective. That force does he have his jump? No, no jump. Not. I thought he burned it, but, yeah, I can confirm what jump was burned and only took 9%. Nero decided it's time to probably quit sleep, sleeping. Uh, I mean, I don't know if that was a decision, but it looks like he kind of just decided, I'm going to stop uh, all your momentum and just start throwing really good stuff. He had, I mean, it was one conversion. That's all that really was. Basically, yeah. yeah so that's all it takes. And that's oh, there's the trip. That's uh -oh. devastating for Falcon because he's going to get grabbed. Yeah, he gets grabbed and then put it into like this vulnerable spot where Ford, oh, he went for that lock. You could tell. Uh, but he puts it, he gets put in this vulnerable spot where like forward air, forward air, forward air connects and so many other things. I'm gonna up do an immediate up B after releasing the ledge and go back to that platform. I don't know if I necessarily agree with that because Nero wasn't putting that much pressure on at that particular moment in time uh, and was able to get a small punish out of it. Ooh. Nero has lapped him and he keeps putting on the percents. Yeah, I, I saw Meek even get up there. Uh, after he fell, and he, could, he had time to shield that dash tech, and he just kind of stood. So it looks like he's slowing down. It, it looks like Nero is pulling this to the pace he wants. Yeah, he's slow. He's finally starting to win that tech of war. Yeah, I mean it took two games, but better late than never. Oh that, my God, that rapid oh, boost! Almost, almost good air dodge. Yeah, both of them almost getting their uh, kill setups. Even though I don't think Nero's would have killed just yet, it would have been close. Wow, that beggar just hit with like two hits randomly. Yeah, holding shield a little too long. Not the, the I no, love that. The no pummel boys. I love that. That was so good because he just held him there waiting for the wind to slide them both off so he could do a down air or another aerial move to Gimp him. Yeah, good attempt there. Nero running away with this one. One strong move and Nero actually will kill Falcon. Indeed. Oh, good up air coming through. But this is Pikachu, so he's fine to come back. And the backer going to go ahead and seal that one out. 
yeah, gonna get the kill there, and you know, Falcon of the Rage is nothing to mess around with. This could, I mean, what, one good up air string to death, really. Yeah. Me or a knee. Yeah, I mean, yeah, up air, up air, up air, knee or something, air dodge read. It's all it takes. That's why you play the character. One. Oh, you're not there gonna get the second go. one. He said he's gonna Nair's net. gonna break it out. Good job, good job dodging that forward smash. Meek's recoveries, like, at the beginning. Hold on, I'll stop talking. <laughs> okay. Meek's recoveries at the beginning of the game uh, were super good, right? Like, he was really uh, using them offensively yes. and defensively. And it looks like, yep, Nero going to get that kill right there. But it looks like his recovery is not as on point as previously. Or Nero made this Nero's, crazy adjustment. I think Nero's reading it. I think he's, his recovery is still really good, but Nero's just reading it. Yeah. He's ru kind of running away and then, like, forcing better options. So, it looks like uh, Nero going to get a game there. We're going to game number four. Say, and both Meek's of momentum. them getting notes. Meek's momentum feels like it's just completely gone. All of a sudden. Pikachu will do that to you, though, because he'll just steal all of it away. Yeah, literally. Like, he just starts under jolting and backing off and then hits the ledge and it starts doing the same thing. And I love when you get a towards the end of a, a tournament and you get, like, a crowd of people watching. It makes the atmosphere a whole lot more hype. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah, we have, what, like nine, ten people? Barely yeah, anybody playing friendlies right now. Super, super crazy. And we got uh, Division taking pictures over there. Make sure everybody knows, hey, Mom! <laughs> hey, Dad. Oh, we're going to angle it even a little better. What's up? Yeah, the venue's super nice here, guys. You missed out. Uh, next time we have something going on here, you definitely need to show up. Big venue, a lot of friendlies. So, I mean, there's like seven open setups right yeah. now. So many friendlies. Brawl, Smash 64. Uh, I mean, Pokemon Stadium, Amiibo knows how to throw a birthday party. Amiibo King, obviously. Sorry. AK. AK, the birthday right. boy. But so, we are going to game number four here. I'm uh, curious as to what's going on here. We should be getting it rolling. We are running under the new rule set. 30 seconds? Yeah, it's been much longer than 30 seconds. So, asking if this is the new rule set. Yeah. So maybe they just didn't even know, right? Like. Now they understand, and we, it looks like we are going to get going it's to Smashville, where, isn't this where Meek won? Oh, this is where Meek was destroying low one, yeah. So, <laughs> you definitely know Meek likes, uh, has no problems with Smashville. He doesn't have a lot of room to run around, like a lot of Falcons like, but he also limits the room that uh, Pikachu can back off to, so. Ooh, we get the, ooh, not going to get the second Nair. That's something we saw him hitting all of uh, previous game with low one. So and yep, it looked like it wasn't set. even it looked like it wasn't even like Nero DI'd out of it or anything. He just kind of didn't convert. So maybe that momentum, man, because Meek was feeling himself and it's kind of just super slowed down. And uh, Nero really having great cross ups right now. So this is where you know Nero's experience as a top player is really I feel like it's coming into his own because like Meek comes in with like lots of explosive pr explosive pressure, but once Nero figures that out, uh, he's really got, seems to have the read on him. And has Meek, his number. Yeah, Meek not up tilt there to up air. Oh my! More God. up airs coming through. Meek not allowed to get away with anything right now. He's trying to, you know, shield grab. Uh, not working. Most of the time, it's just Nero crouched underneath. Oh. Okay. Oh, the oh. no tech voice. But oh. everyone's fine. Pikachu capable of recovering from almost any circumstance. <laughs> it's insane. Yeah. Oh, the good fake right there in the walk away. I like that. Faking the pressure out. But oh, another really good air dodge. Because. Nero's not doing the up throw, so it's not going to be a true combo, so it's definitely air dodgeable. Like, it's it's not a super hard air dodge hit, but it's also super smart. Ooh, jab, jab to grab. Ooh, the up air going to take yeah. the stock right there. That so. looked like it was a frame trap. I don't know what he could have done to escape that. The up airs come out so quick. So, Nero on his, actually on his tournament stock. Yes. This is kind of crazy. Okay, back air going to hit. Didn't Meek get some momentum going? Let's find out. Oh my god, oh. actually gonna get that. Gonna get a free 20% off of up B. So nice to have. How does he get back to stage right now? This is kind of where Nero's been punishing him a lot. Is uh, Whenever he's on that, uh, the ledge. Yeah, anytime the he ledge rolls, pressure. Yeah, he rolls on. Okay, there we go. Bear should take that. Yep. 50% lead for Pikachu, but Pikachu definitely has the easier time bringing back the, the percents. But this is so scary because 50% oh, no, is D percent. Yeah, I was just about oh, to say goodness. that. 50% is down throw to knee if you are yeah. so unsuspecting. Meek going to take an excellent win there. Move on to grand finals against Ryuga. He's got a win on.